Now, it appears as though we got us a yiffa. Uh, uh, a mysterious glowing ball of light traveling at 100th the speed of light has been spotted and videotaped in the Earth's upper atmosphere. Scientists do not know what it is. Brief footage of the image was presented publicly for the first time Monday at the fall meeting of the American Geophysical Union in San Francisco. A graduate student at uh, Crichton University in Nebraska taped the object in August while observing a region of thunderstorm activity it appeared for a simple fraction of a second. In a six-frame sequence, the object can clearly be seen crossing upwards and left across the field of view while retaining its shape and intense glow. One researcher in... Uh, Los Alamos National Laboratory says it's something that has no mass. Hmm. So they, they, I love that. They found something and they don't know what it is. I think I can answer that question right here. All right. From, uh, <laughs> the Weekly World News. All right. Something in there about it? <laughs> Christmas issue. You got something in there? Family claims 500 pound space alien raided their refrigerator. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. Now, wait. Uh, Y'all, uh, this is not coincidence. We just read the story about that and now this? Exactly. There's, there's an illustration Ooh. of the monster, actually. And, uh, oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, my God. You see, see we're that's seeing what it. it. could be. It's you see now. Happened in Germany. School teacher and his family ignited a media frenzy here when they revealed that they had an encounter of the third kind with an extremely fat space alien. <laughs> <laughs> the fat alien who weighed an estimated 500 pounds. Of course, you know, when you, when you hap on an alien right in your refrigerator, you really can't give uh, an exact weight there because it's so frightening. <laughs> well, it's so quick, too. Yeah, they estimate about 500. Sure. And stood about four feet tall. <laughs> Materialized in the family's kitchen and demanded. Oh, he. Oh, and demanded fried foods and pastries. <laughs> <laughs> it was this squishy silver-colored thing with tentacles and a slimy mouth hole. <laughs> what <laughs> sense? And a slimy mouth hole. Uh, demanding fried foods and pastries. Yeah, it tore open our cupboards and stuffed itself on crackers, cookies, and cereal. Then it ransacked the refrigerator. Oh, no, sorry. It was Delta Burke. Uh, sorry, we yeah. didn't realize. That. When it found our plum cake <laughs> and the schnitzel, <laughs> it went wild, <laughs> making loud smacking noises and whimpering. Yeah, it was Delta Burke. Absolutely. Mm. When, it, when it ran out, it threw a fit <laughs> until we gave it more. It was waving its tentacles all around and jumping up and down. We were scared to death. <laughs> the 500-pound alien. The mm. alien appeared uh, to be unaware of their presence and went on uh, searching cupboards and, and, uh, as they watched. We screamed in fear, but the creature didn't pay any attention to us. It was single-minded. All it wanted was to eat. Mm. When my wife called the police, they thought she was a prankster. Really? Mm. No, you just can't take phone calls and just blow them off like you that. You just really you yeah. can't. Uh, meanwhile, we were trapped with this freakish fat thing totally at its mercy. <laughs> my, wife, my wife had to fry up more schnitzel. And bake pastries like crazy to keep the creature satisfied. <laughs> well, okay, well, there she you was go. just slamming right at it now. 500 pound space alien. Uh, you know, there are some believe. In fact, Pam, who works for us, uh, with us here at the station, she firmly believes that everything in these magazines are absolutely true. She she said, well, she, uh, she's going to come back and say, I didn't say every magazine, I said the Inquirer. Okay, the Inquirer. Oh. She believes everything in the Inquirer. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. And so uh, she reads mm -hmm. it and she'll share the information with us. And she, she, she fully goes with whatever's in there.